the bay, 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 Hi guys, good morning. It is, what day is it? Friday? Friday. It's Friday. I um, usually have work from home from Friday, but it's been work from home for six months, five months. So yes, I'm going to switch into my Nyo Noe. So I'm just gonna move some stuff around. Some things are gonna come with me um, to the next bag. So my sunnies, my Victorine wallet, Let's see, I'm gonna put this whole sanitary pouch in here just because I feel, I don't really wanna like do all that. Um, and then I have my toiletry pouch. I feel like I need this. Although the pouch actually does not fit with the organizer. So I'm gonna have to take some stuff out. My sunscreen and then I need toothpicks for my boyfriend and then hand cream and Listerine strips. Oh, I think I put one in here already, actually. Yeah, I did. Okay, so that can stay in there. I need my lip liner. Let's just do our lips right now. Um, so we're gonna go to Honey's Honey's Kettle, which is a fried chicken spot in Culver City, and it's a black owned business. So we're gonna go there. That's what my lips look like. I have a little, it looks like I have a mole, but it was actually a really like, really deep white. <laughs> that I took out and then after that I just like to take some lip balm and then I'm just going to put that over and blend the lip liner together. I hate having to reapply anything honestly. So that looks good I and mean, it just creates like a lip balm color for you. So I really like that. And then this top I'm wearing I'll show you guys my outfit after. Luna's gonna take a nap. We're gonna leave the AC on for her because we're gonna be gone for about three or four hours. So I wanna make sure that she's okay. I'm gonna wear this ring, my Noah ring from Ana Luisa. And then I'll leave a link down below. They didn't give me a code, but I do have a link for you guys. So that's about it from there. And then I'm just going to also bring my mask, of course. These are my masks. And then my lip liner, AirPods. I'll just bring this big hand cream because I might need it. And then my charger because my phone is dying. It's like, I looked at my phone and it's at 97% for battery health. And I think it's because I use a fast chargers. So I put a regular iPhone charger next to the bed. So at night, I, like, I'm obviously not in a rush to go anywhere or do anything. So I just put a regular charger there just so it can charge normally because I feel like that's what's making the battery life go down. Yeah, and then I have this clip here, but I do Kind of like the big claw better if my mom gave me this one and this one i think i'll use this one i like the matte look better but this one holds more hair i'll bring both okay i have my bag chains i do still have a few in stock i think i'm actually going to bring some today so i can ship them out um they'll either be shipped today or tomorrow today's friday yeah i should ship them out today so my Neon Away is packed. Let's go ahead and cinch her in. Just like that. Okay, we gotta get going because we are going. Oh, <laughs> we are going to be late. Hi guys, welcome to the vlog. You guys just saw me switch from my Neverfold to the Neon Away. I have on my necklace, my rings, of course, and then these pants are the Attica jeans from Princess Polly, you guys. The size eight fits perfectly, and I'm usually a size six. Sometimes I can fit into a size four, so definitely go a size up with these. I really love that there's no zipper. Um, there's just like the buttons there, so I really love that. And I'm just wearing these sandals. Um, I really need like some new sandals, so I might go shopping for that when I go to Louis Vuitton. I might get a pair of sandals because I just like have really been wanting one. And I saw like Hermes, but I don't know, like everybody has it, so I don't know. And I feel like the Louis Vuitton ones look a little bit more dressy because you guys know my style is not, it's not like super casual, but it's not like super dressy. So I'm like somewhere in the middle. But yeah, I feel like super pretty today. I don't know why. But anyway, I'll see you guys later. Bye.
pretty girl. Come here. Come here. Oh, you woke up? I wonder where she was snoozing. Hi guys. <laughs> we just got home and I don't feel like getting out of the car. Look at my skin though. I had one pimple here, I got it out. I look kind of oily right now. Um, I think I have a package here, it's from DHL, so we're gonna go check and see what that is. And then plan a little bit in the planner, a little, little planner. I might edit the video today on my planner, what is worth it and what isn't. And hopefully I can have that up for you guys before this vlog is up, so. Hi guys, so it is Saturday. Yeah, Saturday. I just finished filming my unboxing video. You guys will see that first because I want to post that on Sunday and I'm not really doing anything today. I was like, I was like really moody earlier because they were doing construction next door like right when I was about to film and we like wanted to film, go out to lunch and do whatever we wanted to do but then I like got held back and I was, I don't know, for some reason like I was just really upset like my period has me a little moody so yes i was a little upset about that so i literally just went to sleep really really mad i did like it's so, i don't know why like i was just you know when like you finally decide you're gonna do something and i get i got all dressed up and i did my hair and then i did my makeup and then it was just frustrating because like right after that they just started doing construction so yeah so that's what's going on now i'm gonna get something to eat from the kitchen because i'm actually really hungry we're supposed to get dinner from tallulah's which is a local mexican restaurant but i kind of like can't really wait that long now that i finished filming i feel so much better like mm, i just hate that when they do that i just like can't be productive and they've been doing construction on their house for like a long time mm. And I'm eating it out of here just because it's only my boyfriend and I that are home. <gasps> mm. Alright, I think we're going to go out to eat later. I don't think we're going to eat there. I think we're just going to get the food and go. 
For breakfast, I just had a corn dog, and I also had um, I had a Korean corn dog, and I had cereal. It's like a really weird combo. Hey guys, me again. I was gonna start editing, but I decided that I'm just gonna clean the kitchen because it's pretty messy. I'm like embarrassed to show you guys, but yeah, it's pretty messy. I'm gonna throw some stuff out. Like that's pretty much it. I need to clean all those pots and pans. I'm just tired of seeing it there. I think the kitchen is the one place where I have to have it clutter free because I'm just like not about that and I'm always in the kitchen, so I really need it to be clean. Let me know if you guys are like it as well. <laughs> Hi guys, so it is Sunday. My boyfriend went over to his friend's house to clean the pool. Um, the friend that we saw yesterday. So he just went back there, they went for a walk and then he said that he was gonna go in the pool but I'm pretty hungry right now so I'm gonna make something to eat. I've been craving tteokbokki for a long time. So I we were supposed to go to Sautel um, a, few, like a few days ago but we actually didn't end up going and today's a pretty like slow day, I'm just studying and I also filmed um, I filmed a what's in my bag with my Neverfull MM so I forgot to put that in there but I was like I don't think it really matters because I do put more stuff in there like I feel like going from the GM to the MM is like way smaller and the organizer definitely makes the bag a lot smaller and because of the pandemic we have to I mean I already carried sanitizer and wet wipes with me before but I feel like I have to have them in a separate compartment because of I don't know just in case so I want to like reorganize my bag so the what's in my bag portion is just kind of like everything that I threw in there when I went to work the other day I think Thursday yeah I don't really have much footage from that day I didn't really like I haven't really been vlogging like all too much I try to but it's like I don't know it's kind of hard you guys but anyway let me go check the fridge to see what I want to make I kind of want to make the bookie um why do I feel like I'm missing something I think I I think I want to make this. This is noodle shaped dupoki style. And it's two servings, but I'm going to eat like half of it. Oh, so everything comes all together. So I guess I have to make the whole thing. But that's okay. My friend Da Hong, uh, she really likes that one. So I want to try it out. I'm going to put it in cold water. And it's all coming apart. So I'm gonna let that sit and then I need to wash a pan. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna have. It's from H Mart. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put them in here. I can't believe this is two servings. It looks like a little bit. So it says to add everything all together. So I'll just go ahead and do that. And then I'm also gonna go get my air fryer so I can make some of the seaweed. Also this packet. So just cover it with like a big pan. Leave it.
<laughs> so we can see it from the. I'll just pull up right here. No, 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 no. Just go, just go. Just go right wow, that looks so cool. Let's get another one of these. I thought I saw. Oh, the lights off. Hi everyone, welcome to the start of a new vlog. I just finished my makeup and I got dressed and everything. I'm wearing this top from Express. It's the same one in green, but just tan. And I really like the balloon sleeves. And then I'm wearing my white shorts and then my pochette accessoire. I decided to just keep it because a lot of people were telling me that like, it was a unicorn piece and everything and that I wouldn't be able to find it later. So I was like, okay, fine. I'll just keep it. Like there's no harm in doing that. I was considering on letting it go, but I was like, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep it. Cause I feel like it'd just be better, whatever, not have to go through that hassle. And then people like telling me I'm ripping them off or whatever. Um, not that anyone has said that, but just for example, I just decided to keep it as basically the spiel. So yeah, it's just, like really tiny, but it's like, really like low-key that's what i think i like about it because i was gonna get a different bag i'll show you guys today i think i'm gonna go see my ca because i was planning on going tomorrow but um i think some things changed so i might just go in today and ask him if i can see him today because um yeah i think that would be the plan um just to like make my week easier less stress because i do have class so if i can go today rather than tomorrow that would be good for me so so yeah i'll see you guys later bye <music> you guys something so fucked up right now so there is this um there is a black guy in the gardens like near um the old montage and he was like excuse me excuse me to like some people and they i guess they just assumed he was like asking for money <sighs> i can't breathe <laughs> so then um they like ignored him and and then he told me like hey excuse me excuse me and i was like oh yeah like what's up and he, all he asked for <laughs> was for a food store he just wanted to know if there was like a Ralph's or like, you know, a food store nearby. So then I told him like, you know, there was, um, I didn't really understand because he said like a Ralph's. So I was like, oh, I don't know any Ralph's. And then I started walking away, but there's like a Whole Foods that's close by. So I went back and I was like, oh, there's a Whole Foods, like, you know, like a few blocks away. It's only like, I don't know, maybe five minutes walking. So uh, it's just like, like fuck, people are so fucked up nowadays. like people just like are asking for directions or for like a certain place and just because they're like a person of color you're gonna ignore them like it's so fucked up but anyway um so yeah i just told him that and then now i'm walking to louis vuitton because my ca just told me that he had an opening so i would rather go today than tomorrow <sighs> i feel like i can't breathe like the air is really bad like i don't think it's just the mask i think it's the air but anyway, oh, there it is. The first bag that I decided to try on was the Odeon MM, and I wanted to try on the MM size because I feel like the PM was just a little bit too small, and I actually really like this bag. At first, when I saw it advertised on the Louis Vuitton email, like the subscription letter that they sent everyone through the email, I didn't really like it and I thought it looked like a more mature bag for kind of older women. I'm sorry, don't get offended, okay? <laughs> Please do not get offended. I definitely felt like the style was just kind of like not so young and fresh, but it was a little bit more mature, which I wasn't a huge fan of at first, but when I did put it on, I did really like it, but I felt like the shape was just not for me. 
I do realize that it is flat to kind of lay against your body really well, but it had the shape similar to an Alma where it kind of just tapers up, but this bag is really flexible. You can really fit a lot in it and it will expand and get a little bit puffier, but for me, I just didn't really feel like that was something that I wanted, but I do really like the style of this bag and I think that it really suits kind of my age and maybe a little bit older. I don't think that the younger crowd would like this too much because it is kind of like a more, I still think it's a more mature bag, but maybe not that mature. Next, I did try on the bum bag. I kind of was like a little iffy about this one only because this one was a used one. My CA said that he actually set one aside for me and someone switched them out. So that's why I didn't end up getting this one that day. And then I did try on the corset, which I did really like, but it is hard to close when it's empty. Granted, I don't think that if I use it, obviously it won't be empty, but the hardware is something that you do have to be aware of because it will get scratches. This one is in the Dami Iben print. I know some people said I said Dami Ibin, and I do like, you know, tomato, tomato. Sometimes I say it correctly, sometimes I don't. But I do like this handheld. I think this is really cute. This is something I would choose over the Alma BB. I know the Alma BB, everyone chooses that one first. But you guys know, if you guys have followed me, my whole dilemma with that. So, yes. And then I tried on the multi pochette. They also had the khaki version, but I love the pink one so much more. So I've been debating between the bum bag and between the multi pochette. I'm still not exactly sure which one I should get and I do talk to you guys about that later and these are the two I think they both serve different purposes but because I do have a mini pochette already I don't think that the multi pochette might be for me hey guys so I just finished at Louis Vuitton as you can see I have no bags with me because I had my CA order what I wanted, or not order, but he has to wait for another one to come in because both of the items that I tried on were used. So if you guys can guess what I'm getting. Um, yeah, I don't know. It was like hard for me to make my decision because I'm also basing it off of a trip for next year, but I was like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm like really undecided right now. So I'm going to try to make my decision tonight and then I'll let him know um, which one I want him to order. So yeah, I'm just waiting for my boyfriend right now. He's gonna pull up in front of Burberry. So yeah, I was in there for like less than 30 minutes and then I saw the holiday collection. Uh, just like a preview, I'm sure everyone has seen it online. And then I'm also, what else was I looking at? Oh, like the Nano Noe, like the new one with the luggage tag. That one was actually pretty cute. But yeah, uh, you guys will see what I get in my birthday unboxing video. Cause I'm like, oh, I'm so not sure. But yeah. I'll let you guys, um, you guys will obviously see, so yeah, bye. Came to Petco to get Luna some treats. Let's see if they have it. she loves when I throw them that's all only two these are a little bit bigger so I don't give her too many oh wait look at you have so many oh so yummy she knows they're hers hi everyone we're gonna go on a sunset drive I need my mask oh no I have I think I have some in the car okay so this is my outfit for our sunset drive you guys can see the sun is setting back there um this is from rebellious fashion from a long time ago I did a video with them a long time ago and um I'm like actually terrified to have this rub against I'm gonna put this strap up a little higher and then maybe wear it like bum bag style 
I don't know. <laughs> Um, I don't really want it to rub against my jeans, but these are like jeggings from Abercrombie. They look black, but they're not. They're like this dark blue, super dark blue color. And then I'm just wearing my Supergos. Um, I'm gonna scotch guard like some of my jeans because I don't want them to stain my Azure because she is so pretty and fresh. Anyway, I'm gonna take a photo for Instagram and I'll see you guys later. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Maybe get Chipotle. No, my stomach's gonna hurt after that. I think, um, I don't know what food is in Malibu, but we'll get something. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.